Hey, my name is Gay, and this is a video on how I installed IKEA's Sanvidel roller blinds. It's a quick installation. It can be done in less than 30 minutes. You don't need much to get it done, and I'll let you know what you need. And at the end, I'll give a review on the installation process and the roller blinds itself, and see if it's worth your time and effort. And don't forget, please like and subscribe. So you need a measuring tape, a pencil, leveler, a hammer, a ladder, and a few screws and a screwdriver. So here's what's inside the packaging. The blind itself, a small box with some bits inside of it, the user manual, and do not throw this thing. It's a marking guide that will make your life a lot easier. In the tiny box, you'll find the left end of the blind. You'll notice that it has the plastic sticking out. The right end of the blind and the tugging handle. Now get the ladder and start installing. First thing to do is measure the width of your window and find the center point because that will be the guide for where you will place the marking tool. Now grab the marking tool and the leveler like this and start marking your screw holes. There will be crosses at the ends that will tell you where to put the pencil. Next, grab the hammer and make a dent on the marks. This will make screw driving later on a whole lot easier. Now you can start screwing on the blind ends. Make sure to not tighten it so that you can make adjustments later. Now make sure to put back on the plastic bit if it falls off. Now do the right end of the blind. Once again, don't tighten it. Now you can put the blind on, make some adjustments, remove that plastic end on the left side, and once you're happy, you can tighten the screws. And now you can try out the blind. Now insert the tug fixture, just go from the side and slide it to the middle. You're basically done. Now all I needed at this point was to install the other blind. It's self-raising. Just do a quick tug. One thing I was unhappy about is that one of the blinds was defective. IKEA quality assurance, please. Also, the ends are too plasticky. I don't know how long they'll last. The material feels nice though, feels fancy. It's pretty good at blocking the view from outside during the day. You wouldn't see me if I made a fool out of myself. Installation was a breeze. Like I said earlier, it only took me 30 minutes. Now as to the question of, is it worth my time and effort? I definitely would say yes. Cause the blinds cost me only $70 and it only took me 30 minutes to install one, so that's an hour for both of them. Compared to if I would pay someone else to do it, it would cost around 220 to 250 to install a blind. So that's 440 to $500 for both blinds. Most of the websites I went to also required that someone would have to come to your house and do a free measurement. So you'd have to deal with having them come to your house to do it. Or, you know, the awkwardness of turning them down. Now, I don't know if they're gonna do the installation right after the measurement, but that would be another thing that you would think about. You'd have to set a day for them to come to measure the window and then set up another date and time for them to install it. So again, that's another thing that you have to consider. So that would be time and money lost because you're at home and not out there working. Yeah, overall, it was a good experience. And I hope this video helps you decide if you want to get the San Vidal, San Vidal roller, bl San Vidal roller blinds. And please don't forget to like and subscribe. It would really help my channel out. And um, check out my other videos. Maybe you'll find something helpful there. Once again, thanks. Um, see you in the next one.